Hello there, this is a very quick video showing the setup of this fella. It's a Samus 725 MP electro fishing unit from Samus Electronics. Apologies to people who watched my previous video on this subject. I actually had one of the wires in the wrong place and I didn't realise even after editing it for ages. So that video has been deleted. This is the new one. This is the proper one. Right, the Samus has two wires coming out of it. One's red, one's black. And ordinarily, they'd be separate wires. I've taped these two together. All the way down until about a foot from the end. And that keeps them nice and tidy. But it also allows them to be splayed apart and attached to a car battery. So they're the wires that are fixed. There's two wires that go to your net. The black one goes on the positive and that goes onto the ring of your net. Second one is this fella. This goes in here marked start and the other end of this has a switch on. I've taped that onto my net and that is used to put a charge through the water basically to allow the machine to work. When you depress that power flows from the battery through this unit to the end of your net bang zaps the fish. So in a similar way to the two wires which are fixed on the electro fishing unit I've taped the switch wire and the positive wire all the way down just to keep them nice and tidy they're pretty much the same length so it's worth doing that to keep them tidy and they run in the bottom end of the net handle here and I've used pipe insulation over the handle and in the little valley that's created in there I've just run the cable up all the way to the end this is the positive cable and it wraps around a copper wire which goes all the way around the net this particular net doesn't have an aluminium loop which runs all the way around it's got a little bit of aluminium but it just goes from the shaft to the end here doesn't go all the way around so I've used the copper wire all the way around linked my positive to that and it works pretty well so by taping that on in that position it allows me to use my left hand or my right hand to switch the machine on and by insulating the handle just keeps everything nice and comfortable and safe. The only other wire that you need has this mass of braided copper on the end. This is what hangs out the back of the boat or trails behind you and this is the negative. Well, this is a really long cable and this end goes to the negative there. So positive to the net, negative trailing behind you switch plugged in there positive and negative on the battery and you're ready to fish just a quick note on the battery that I'm using this is actually out of a four-wheel drive it's a damn heavy battery and that's the details of it 700 amps 12 volts 75 amps amp hours 20 hours it's a beast of a battery and it should last a hell of a long time should see the machine come on here as soon as these are attached that's it the machine's on you program it and fish in the next part of the video I will actually be doing some fishing. 
I have actually been out fishing with it already with mixed success, it was my first time out um, I tried it by myself and paddling the boat and using an electro fishing setup is very very difficult so I had my two children helping me and it was only marginally easier tomorrow I've got one of my mates coming and we're going to give it a real good go and providing it isn't raining or windy we should get a decent bit of footage for part two. Thanks for watching.